What's going on everybody? Welcome again back to the channel. Welcome back for another NASCAR diecast review. Today I'm going to be showing you this Ward Burton it's number 22 MBNA car. This is from 1996. Some racing collectibles. Club of America. Some of the cars that first came out before action took over. So so these are always cool cars, really nice. I mean, they weren't highly, um, what do you want to call it? Um, I don't know, they weren't highly sought after cars or anything like that. I mean, they were pretty nice cars at the time. Again, this is from 1996. Got this. So, yeah, they're uh, not really too detailed. As compared to uh, later cars. But it's a pretty cool. It's a Pontiac Grand Prix. We got your uh, Ward Burton on the side. Number 22. You know the roof flaps don't, don't come open. They look like it but they don't. You got the plastic netting in there. It's a little bit detailed on the side but it's not... Not horribly detailed. I mean, it could be a lot better, but. And uh, size, the, all the contingency stickers, and get the Goodyear tires, which aren't too bad. They're pretty good. Still rubber. MBNA, MasterCard. And you got the truck deck lid that opens up and shows you the fuel cylinder. It's not too uh, too detailed up, but it is a little bit. I'll shut that. Show you the other side. So it's pretty good for 1996, but they compared, you know, nowadays. Yeah, it's not too detailed up. And we got the underneath. It's all plastic, all molded together. Some of it's painted separate, some of it's not. Some of it just makes it look like it's been painted separate. But pretty much the whole bottom's all plastic, all molded together. Except for part of the engine, that's kind of, that's molded separate. The body itself is all die cast. And you got the hood underneath there, and it says MBNA. And you got the yeah, pretty standard size engine in there. Not too detailed or anything like that, but... At least it's got one. Another thing I wanted to show you that it does have some springs to it. So as you can kind of see, the backs don't, but the front does. So kind of if you look at this, if you look at the car, you can kind of press it down. So it does have some springs there. But of course the back doesn't. So that's pretty cool. Like saying for being for what, 1996, I'm gonna say 2006, 16, almost 30 years old. It's a pretty cool car, pretty nice. You know what you expect from a almost 30 year old car. But you know they don't make them like this anymore. Neither are some really nice race cars <clears throat> back in the nice uh, NASCAR old days. I should say old days of NASCAR. So. But, uh, yeah, it's one of the older cars that I've gotten. Um, pretty nice. I like it. It's pretty, uh, what do you want to say, uh, vintage, I guess you want to call it. So, but if you guys are, uh, ever come across any of these older cars, you know, if you can get them for 10 bucks or something like that, they're, uh, I'd go ahead and grab them. So, but again, thanks, again, guys, thanks for, uh, watching. Hope you like these videos. I'm trying to hit uh, 400 subscribers. I might have get just gotten 400 subscribers on my channel. Uh, if we did, it's great, awesome. You know, it's been a while, but hey, you know, I'm, <clears throat> I'm gonna look at my channel real quick, see how many I see how many I did get. But I think I do got 400. But next up, we're trying to get to 500. So we'll keep uh, doing these uh, videos. 
You guys keep telling uh, anybody else that likes NASCAR diecast videos to subscribe to my channel. And we've we'll got more of them coming. Plenty, plenty more. I'll probably never stop. So, thanks again for watching, guys. Please like, subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell. Give me a thumbs up so I know you liked the, vi the video. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks again for watching. Bye.